So let's say that you're given an x value, like they give us over here, as x equals to negative 5, and you try to find the y value. So this is the same as when we're trying to find the y-intercept. So here's the steps that you would do. Here's the equation we're using, and there's a graph for it. And I'm interested in finding when x is negative 5, so I would go second trace, option number 1, negative 5 for x, and enter. So you get this y value, which is negative 5.66666 repeated. Now, if you want to convert this y value into a fraction, what do, you, what do you have to do? So first of all, you need to quit the graphing page. So you're going to go second mode. So that's to quit the graphing page. Now we will need to enter y here so that, so that the calculator knows that we want that exact value of y that was in the graphing page to be converted. So y is written right here in the backdrop of 1, and it's in green. So when you're trying to access anything in yellow, you press the second button. But if you're trying to access anything in the backdrop as a, that's in green, you have to press the alpha button. So you're going to press alpha 1. So this will bring the y up. And then we're going to go under math. We're going to pick option number 1, which is to convert it into fraction. So you'll see it says y into fraction. And then you're going to hit enter. So it converted that um, uh, decimal number into a fraction for us.